Okay. All right. Well, my girlfriend and I have gone on a quest since this starting Monday. We've been on a quest to go and get two of each one of the McDonald's Halloween buckets that I know a lot of people are freaking out about right now. And this coming, what was it, Monday? Monday, we went to our local McDonald's and we found they had a good supply of the McBoo bucket. And I've been looking since last night online at old retro commercials for this. I haven't tried it out yet, but I know like back in the 80s, these old McBoo buckets would glow in the dark, but we haven't tried that out just yet, but they're pretty neat. Each single last one of them actually has three different facial expressions. And if you look on here, you can see that's the McBoo. And each one is gonna come with its own sticker set that you can put on the back of the little skeleton on the back. And I know it's kind of a bum out for, you know, some Gen Xers like me that they don't have the little cookie cutter lids on them anymore, but they have the nice little top over here. And if you look over here, actually my girlfriend and I, we weren't really arguing, but we were kind of trying to decide whether or not the green one was the witch or the goblin. But it's actually kind of a little bit of both. I don't think that McDonald's is going to put witch on one of their buckets because, you know, I might have some kind of weird family implications. But if you look on here, it's the McGoblin. And just like the other ones, it has three different little facial expressions that are on it. Show everybody over at home. Each one of them has the little skeletons, and we've got the little stickers that go on each one. You can tell that this one, the motif is kind of a little bitty werewolf and got the one that for me is my favorite one definitely the mick pumpkin you can see the different little facial expressions that each one of them comes with the pumpkin of course has the pumpkin motif and i know that people well we've been going from yesterday i think we went to about five different McDonald's and we kept asking them if they had the green one because we were lucky enough to find the McBoo and the McPunkin without having to look really hard but the McGoblin one we kind of had to go on a little quest for those and every McDonald's that we went to they always said we're gonna have a new bucket each week but I think that that's not necessarily true they're probably just grabbing like a box of buckets that they have in storage in the back and it's kind of going to be the luck of the draw if you're going to end up going into your McDonald's, depending on which one's going to be there. But we didn't have to really work that hard to go and find each one of the buckets in one week. So if you really want to work hard enough and do a little bit of footwork, you can definitely find each one of the buckets if you end up looking hard enough. They're really nice. My girlfriend and I really are into Halloween and the spirit of the season. So they're definitely a nice, happy addition. Thank you, McDonald's.